What's up guys, GGB's good here, and you've tuned in to the next part of this Earthbound LP. When we last left off, we made it through the Cave of the Past, and, uh, well, we're going to attempt to fight the final boss right now. Of course, I'm totally probably just gonna die, but we'll see. <laughs> we will see here. It gets a little nasty, but we'll see what happens. I don't think there are any, any enemies at this part. Um, let me see. Is everyone at full HP? Yes, actually. Wow, he's running low on PP. But I think it's okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna save things I have for when I need them. So let's go ahead and do that. Uh oh. Can't move right now. Oh my god. I don't want to fit. What? <laughs> Is that me? <laughs> That's a me. This is really weird. Oh, you son of a bi- Oh. Oh. <laughs> God damn it, Pokey. <laughs> And Abel, that's Pokey. You guys look pathetic. The Apple of Enlightenment has already made a prediction. But I won't let what the Apple of Enlightenment predicted take place. You guys will be beaten by Gigas. Gigas will be stronger, a more powerful entity than any other. Why? Because of me! I was led by Gigas, and now I'm here. The Apple of Enlightenment... Couldn't predict this. Master Gigas. No, Gigas is no longer the wielder of evil. He has become the embodiment of evil itself, which he cannot control on his own. He is the evil power. What? Straight into that fight? So, heavily armed Pokey. Um... So, as far as I know, in this battle, Gigas, I can't, at least in this phase, I can't, um, hurt. I can't hurt Gigas right now. So, I think the best plan of action, course of action, would be to... I think I can use... Paralysis? On, I think our best plan is to attack Pokey right now. And she should use... Sorry, assist. On everyone. And he, of course, has these multi-bottle rockets for a reason. And let's see. I guess he has freeze, right? That's a pretty good one. Although, I don't know if I want to... Yeah, might as well. This is the last boss. We gotta go for it. 202, not bad. Of course, that's gonna do a lot of damage because Paula did not go before him. God damn it. This might work. Yes, that worked. That's awesome. Alright, so we're all protected now. We took some damage, but not too much. Multiply bottle rocket. 121, that's it. Jesus. Alright, I'm gonna heal her, because she's pretty key to this battle right now. There's a, a point in this battle where I I should be using the, um, what's it called? The prey that she can do? I think we should be fine. It just makes it disappear and then they're still up. That's awesome. I won't question it. Alright, so we're lucky. We've body. We're pretty much bodying uh, Pokey right now, so I don't have to worry about that. Wow, that did way more damage than last time. 
Alright, I might as well heal everyone while I can. And then attack while I can. I don't know though, Stan is running unfortunately low on on things of this sort. <laughs> so that's odd. So basically I wanted to use that um, Psy Shields, I guess it's Sigma. Um, ooh. Yeah, oh, it's going up. Um, so well, let me explain this. I So Gigas, basically that big uh, pixelated picture of Ness, um, actually has a super shield or whatever, the shield that reflects everything back at you. So I used um, Psychic Shield Sigma in order to make things disappear without reflecting them, because if I reflected it at him, then he would just reflect it back and hit me. So um, yeah, you want it to absorb the psychic powers but not reflect them at this point. I understand you guys are already claiming to be heroes. Well. It is a gazillion years too early for you to oppose Gigas. You must feel pretty stupid to make fight to keep fighting without even knowing what Gigas looks like. Oh, what is going on? If you were to ever see Gigas, you'd be so petrified with fear, you'd never be able to run away. <laughs> That's how scary it is. So you so do you want me to turn off the devil's machine? Well prepare to be amazed. So isn't this terrifying? I'm terrified too. Um, Gigas cannot think rationally anymore. Uh oh. And he isn't even aware of what he is doing now. His own mind was destroyed by the, his incredible power. What an almighty idiot. <laughs> yep, that's what he is. <laughs> and you, you will be just another meal to him. Pokey's a piece of shit. Okay, so we're fighting Gigas, so... So right now, multi-bottle rockets don't work on him, so we should use the heavy bazooka. And we should use... Steak. <laughs> It'll fill sometimes, and then... Okay, so... Here we go. We want to use this, that costs a lot. I assume this is useful. Heavy bazooka. I'm gonna use brain shock. <laughs> Weird, what's going on? Yeah, I bet you feel strange. <laughs> Whoa, what's going on? Yeah, so sometimes that doesn't work, but sometimes it does work, so you gotta keep using it. I think I'm gonna run out of PP though, unfortunately. Which is actually horrible. Oh my god. That did a lot of damage, it's not bad. I really need this to hit right now because I'm screwed otherwise. Alright, I'm gonna hit and then... She can't use this. This is tough because I should have healed. I guess I can use this one on him. Because that gives me more PP. I think he needs more PP. Oh yeah, he still does. Whoa, he's back.
Um, <laughs> you must really be at the end of your rope. In this bizarre dimension, you four are the only force fighting for justice. Um, okay, so now he's going to turn into the final form right now. <laughs> Waiting to be burned up with all the rest of the garbage in this universe. That's so sad. I can't help you. I can't help but shed a tear. You know, my heart is beating incredibly fast. I must be experiencing absolute terror. Do you want to scream for help here in the dark? <laughs> Why not call your mommy, Juju? Say mommy, daddy. I'm so frightened. <laughs> I think I'm going to wet my pants. <laughs> I know you have telepathy, or something, so just try to call for help, you pathetically weak heroes of so-called justice. No one will help you now. Whoa! So basically right now I think... I think we should, what we should be doing is defend and pray and have everyone else defend and after nine turns of this um, it'll reach a different person or group and their own prayers will inflict it. So basically if we do this um, it's going to do damage here to him. Uh oh. Please give us strength. If it is possible, please, somebody help us. Who's gonna help us? This is epic. Uh, awkward. <laughs> oh my god, what's going on? What is going on? Oh, is this epic? Is this gonna happen? All of the Mr. Saturns felt a new startling feeling they had never experienced before, and they all started praying for the safety of Juju and his friends. Da, da, da. What's going on? Whoa! defense became unstable all right I don't know which one gets rid of that but I'm gonna take a chance here or maybe I shouldn't take any chances she needs to keep praying Juju bees good. Pray from the bottom of her heart. Anyone who can hear our plea, help us. This is like uh, Goku using the spirit bomb right now to defeat <laughs> to defeat anyone he be he beats it with. This is so epic. This is actually a really cool way to. And the boss. Suddenly, one of the runaway five felt something stop him. And he prayed fervently for Juju and his friends. Wow, that was a lot of damage. <laughs> Thanks a lot, <laughs> assholes. I don't. I really don't think anyone can. I don't know which one heals what, so. Go back, friends. I'm happy. What is happening? Finally stopped crying. Speed this prayer to all the people. Over I wonder if um, 
Dragon Ball Z was influenced by this game at some point. That would be crazy, right? The spirit bomb is actually just Jess praying. Or Paula praying. What? Oh, this is an epic prayer. This is an epic prayer. Here we go. 99 damage. That's a lot. <laughs> You cannot grasp the true form of Gigas. Wow, that's a lot. That's not good. Alright, so I need to heal her now. Oh man, who are these? I don't even remember these kids. What's going down? <laughs> Tony felt anxious about Dan. Oh. oh, okay. I remember these guys. I remember these ones. Oh, that's it's getting more powerful. We need to heal her. We need to keep her alive. He's starting to do damage to us, so we need to be careful. It's not right, not right, not right! Oh, crap! Oh, thank god. Well, that's fine, whatever. I don't even think they really matter too much. Oh, sweet. This is going to be a powerful attack. I can feel it. I can feel it right now. Where are you coming from? All the ladies like... <laughs> all the ladies like Stan, that's all I gotta say. Nice! Doubling in damage here. I'm gonna try just defending a nut. Oh, okay. Well... Well, he's numb, that's why. Okay. But he can do stuff, so I'm just going to have him defend. Yes! Here we go. Here we go. Is this going to be epic? Or what? <laughs> wow, that was a lot of damage. Bash. No, I don't think we should be attacking him. Here we go, here we go. He's gonna attack us right now, I think. Oh no, we just go for the attack. All the power! Everyone on Earth! Lend me your strength! <laughs> what up, mommy? <laughs> oh, she's gotta pray for us. This is the strongest prayer, of course. Oh, po Pogo, right? Or Toto? I don't know what I named it. <laughs> this game's ridiculous. Wow, that was uh, that's got to be it, right? Yeah. Oh my god, what's going on? This is really trippy, man. <laughs> this is really trippy, man. I feel good. Good. You cannot grasp the true form of Gigas. 
no one can grasp the true form of Gigas. Whoa, that's really way too much to be looking at. I don't know if I should be looking at this. Okay. By the darkness. Wait, what? Am I supposed to bash? <laughs> I'm gonna try bashing. I don't know what's going on. Well. Prayed from the bottom of the heart. This is it. Could this be it? You go Jujubes Oh my god all the kids who never met him so much damage to him Kept praying we gotta keep praying Jujube is good praying Wow that's a lot of damage We must keep praying Holy crap. Wow, this is the power of prayer, huh? <laughs> Defeats all evil, of course. I don't condone religion. You guys can be religious if you want. <laughs> wow, this is... This is happening. Okay. Wow. What? It's pokey! Now I... Well... It's going to seem like I'm running away, but perhaps I j I'll just sneak away and do another era to think about what my next plan is. It's a good bet that we will see each other again, you son of a bitch, Pokey. Look, he's not even a human anymore. He's blue. <laughs> ha! He's just gone. This is really crazy. Whoa. Oh my god. I don't even know if I can look at the screen right now. This is too much. Holy crap. Oh shit. Is that it? Oh my god. What the fuck just happened? Mommy! <laughs> Robots! Oh no. The war against Gigas is over. This music's epic, though. The souls of the children were saved. But Ness's hat was left behind. No, it wasn't. It's on his head. Why did... How did that happen? <laughs> I'm tearing up, guys. This is amazing. It's been a long six or seven months, and I finally beat this game. I'm very happy. I like how the mouse is there. He's a, an important character. What's going on? 
our travels together end here. I must return to Dalam and use this experience for the good of my country, Juju Justin. Let me demonstrate a strange power before I go. Sigh farewell. <laughs> Okay. Sorry, my mic died out there for a little. Okay, we're back in it. It was great to hang out with you guys. It really was. Glad I had the chance to use some of the theories that I've been studying so hard. It's remarkable. Just maybe, well, if you two get hitched someday, maybe I'll be the one that fixes your broken electronic appliances. Ha <laughs> ha. I'm going to stay here for a while and see if I can learn more from Dr. Andonuts. I mean, from my dad. So, it looks like this is a good bye for now, my friends. Oh. Hell yeah. To being just a regular kid. Well, I gotta get going. I'm taking this girl home. We out. I gotta get the presents so. though. Letter from the kids. Letter from the moms. Letter from Tony. How are you doing? I'm fine. I'm f I find too. So are me. Me also. Please come back. All right. All right. All right. Let's. I mean, I don't really know. What, I guess we have to take her home. Gotta get that steak though. Pogo. Where does she live? Twasson, maybe? Whatever, I'm just go I think this is where she lives. Although, I could be incredibly wrong about that. Chaos Theater. I think I'm right, though. She lives in... This area? Yes, okay, great. Thank you for escorting me home. There was something I wanted to tell you, but I've forgotten it. I'm sure I'll remember by the time I see you again. Goodbye, uh, so long, see ya, bye. <laughs> Peace. We out, girl. I'll, talk, I'll call you later, don't worry. Don't worry. Alright, let's go... Where are you? Did I even pick the right place? I hope I did. Nope. <laughs> On it, that's where I want to go.
Oh, I, I did pick the right one. Okay. <laughs> Check that out. All right, let's go home because I think that's the real uh, part of the game. I think you're also allowed to explore the world a little bit, but I've played this game enough. I had my time with this game. I might come back to it later. We'll see. Yeah, if you guys want to see the rest of the world, I guess, um, tell me in the comment section below. I'll definitely do that for you guys. But until now, we'll just, for now, we'll just go home, talk to mommy. <laughs> he brought by an album. Yeah, of course I'd... Hold on. We're gonna make a restore point. And then we're gonna say yes. We did so well! <laughs> Everyone just starts dancing. Where'd she go for? Yes, we finally did it, guys. We finally did it. I'd like to say thank my mom. I'd like to say that you guys are the best. Buzz Buzz. Um, unfortunately, Buzz Buzz died. Is this the cast in order of appearance? <laughs> This is pretty cool. Um, I'd like to thank you guys the most for sticking through this unbelievably long and drawn out LP. It's the first one I've ever done, but it's not the first one I completed. This is the first one I started. Uh, the first one I completed is actually Bayonetta 2, if you guys want to check that out on my channel. But good old Orange Kid and Apple Kid. Uh, yeah, so anyways, I mean, it means a lot. If you guys stuck through. Um, and just anyone who watched just a random episode means a lot to me. Leave a thumbs up if you like the video. Um, I guess I'll be here for the end of this. The credits. This is this means a lot to me. This game. I love Earthbound. Um, and I had a lot of fun playing it. You guys should go definitely check it out for yourself. Um, there, I, I know there are a lot of things. Tessie. Oh my god, I know there are a lot of things I missed out on this LP. You can feel free to tell me which things I missed out. I know there are a bunch of weapons for, uh, or just, yeah, I, get, I think there's just a hundred. No, there's just a bunch of weapons that I missed out on, and a bunch of equipment for uh, Pooh that I missed out on. But I beat the game anyways, right? So why do we need that? I'm kidding. Mr. Saturn! Master Belch. Oh my god. Great characters. Yeah, so um, why don't you guys go ahead and suggest a new game or I don't know. Yeah, has to be a game for it to be a Let's Play, I suppose. But that you might want to see me play in the future. It doesn't have to be an RPG. I personally love RPGs, but I will play through any game I can get my hands on as long as it's worth my time. Um... So, thanks so much for watching, guys. Leave a thumbs up if you like the video. And, um, we'll just let this roll for a little bit. Wow, they're really putting everyone in here. <laughs> I'm glad, it's cool. That was actually a really cool credits thing. Had nothing to do with any of the game designers or anything, just straight up all the characters in the game. <laughs> they don't want to give credit to anyone for making this game. 
but it seems that we forgot one character. One very important character. Who could it be? Oh, is now they're going to show us all the pictures? Because that's the uh, Fuzzy Pickles guy. I like that guy. Yay. <laughs> that would be cool if... Um... Oh, now it's the real staff. Okay. <laughs> Look at that picture. Itoi Shigesato. I don't know how to pronounce it, it seems. He must be a weird guy. <laughs> Akihiko... Miura. Alright, well. I mean, I'd let this run. It would be an incredibly long video, I suppose. But there is something that happens at the end, which I don't want to spoil, so I guess I'll let it run. It's kind of a... It's a short, uh... Short thing. But I guess it's worth looking at. You guys might as well, uh... I mean, I'll talk... <laughs> I'll try to fill up this, uh, <laughs> this time with me talking about random things, but, or pronouncing these names horribly. Hiro Yuka, Yuki, um, and that would be my controller falling asleep. Okay. Hiro Yuki Sakiyami. <laughs> Sakiyami. I can pronounce them horribly. I can try to pronounce them, but it doesn't matter. Anyways, you guys might as well just skip ahead to see what happens. Um, I'll I'll let it record. Because um, I like to see these pictures. <laughs> it's nice to see that these pictures, I'll actually get to see them at some point. Or I actually got to see them. That was a good one. I remember that. Classic episode where you have to stand still for like three minutes. <laughs> that was a classic episode or point in this game. Oh man. It's been a long journey, guys. I don't know. Maybe I should choose shorter games next time. Although, completing an entire game in under 50 episodes, not bad. That's not bad. An entire RPG being. That's why it's not bad. Kazuhide Ogoe Atsushi Miyaki Alright, I don't want to be racist and pronounce games in that <laughs> in that manner. It might offend someone. I'm just kidding, of course. I don't mean to be racist. <laughs> okay, question mark. What's going on there? What? That was a little weird. But then again, this game is very weird. I like all the sprites in this game a lot, though. They're cool. Okay, and many others. <laughs> the producers wish to thank Ishel Art Vision, Moon Raiders Office, Setic Inc., Lucky Nice. I don't know if any of these things exist anymore, right? Because this game's rather old. Chief Coordinator was Marker Marcus Lindblom. Satoru Iwata. I didn't know he was a uh, co-producer. I don't know what co-producer means. Satoru Iwata. 
Supervisor Shigeru Miyamoto. I didn't know he was a supervisor in this game. I guess he must be a supervisor in every Nintendo game. What? HAL Laboratory? Laboratory? I didn't know that. <laughs> yes! Of course, the most important person on the staff of Earthbound was Jujubee's Good. <laughs> That's awesome. I think more games should do that. That's pretty cool. Cool credits. Credits worth watching to see my name. Alright, can I press A or start? Because this... This episode's going really long. I just want it to show the part at the end of this. <laughs> Oops. Yes, okay. <laughs> There's one thing after this that's worth watching. I suppose. Hello, it's your dad. You've been there for a long time now. No. <laughs> I I understand your point about the fate of the world being at stake. Look. All right, now we can go downstairs. This is just like the beginning of the game. What's going on? Is that Pokey? Oh, from my brother Pokey. It is addressed to Juju. There is no stamp and it's not time for the mailman to come. Anyway, brought it over. It says, come and get me, loser. Spankity, spankity, spankity. I wonder where he is. What? The end? Question mark! Da, da, da. Anyways, that's all I wanted to show you guys, I think. Yeah, that's all I wanted to show you guys. Thanks so much for watching this series. It's, uh, it's a long time coming. We finally finished the game. So, until next time, guys. I'm GGB's Good, and I'll catch you then. Peace out.